Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome along to a brand new, or another, sorry, Portal 2 mod on our Master Portal Quest tonight. We are playing Portal 2 Dreams of Science. So, our blurb for this one is, you don't know who you are. You in this trap. Again, you dream to get out of this circle, but again, you come back to the past. Try to dream on the contrary of science. And that's literally all we've got. That is literally all we've got. So I um, downloaded this mod earlier on and um, I was, when I downloaded it, I noticed that there wasn't really much of a structure. Um, literally the download was just a zip file full of maps. So I looked at and delved in some more information. Um, apparently there's no order. It's just a map pack. There is no story as such. There is no order to the maps. The map maker says you can play it in any order you want. Um, so I've just literally got a list of map names that I've chucked into the folder. And um, I guess we're just going to go through them one by one because there isn't uh, any sort of um, set order as such. So very, it'll be very interesting to see um whereabouts we go with this one but without further ado let's jump into the first one um and see what sort of quality awaits us in dreams of science sponsored by cherry Pepsi max oh, okay Well, straight away, that was... It's almost like it was going to give me... Well, yeah, I can see it already. It's almost like it was giving me a portal gun, but it didn't. Also, lighting. Oh my god, what is going on up there? What is going on up there? You sound surprised. I'm. I don't really think we can be too surprised. I mean, like I said before, um, the mod wasn't exactly how I'd. I assume that's what I meant to do. It wasn't how I'd sort of um, imagined things. I wasn't sort of expecting a mod that uh, was literally no order to it, so so I'm not sure I'm meant to get up here, but uh, yeah, I'm not sure what the plan is with this really. I can hear something like splashing away in the distance. Maybe I am meant to go up there. Is there something else up there? <laughs> we'll just call this Rogan's mod. I think that's, that, that's probably best, right? Is that literally just an observation room just to... Okay. There is a way in there, okay. Can I shoot a portal from in here? Okay, I can. I, just, I, I don't know where this is going to go, but... So you can get to all these BTS areas. Okay. Um, kind of worried and confused, but yeah, I think you can tell from the blockiness here. That um, things and stuff 
I can only assume I, I'm, a, I'm meant to come this way. Genuinely don't know, but... Also, those dropping noises are... Uh, I just, come, I just came from this way, didn't I? Yes, I did. I mean, look at that. That's a thing of beauty. I kid you not. Um, also, I, I get through here. Um, is there a is there a way to get back? I, I don't see a portal surface to to get back. Which would then sort of say to me, I'm I'm missing something. Probably actually missing a lot, but I hope. Let's see why all these like weird, all these things over like over here and, and, and out here. I mean, answers on a postcard. Was I... Was I meant to, to stand on that? Was I meant to stand on that? I mean, that's the exit, right? So... Um... Also, I'm trapped. See, I'm not really sure how, you, as a player, you're meant to get to the exit then. Um, well, it's certainly set the tone for the rest of the map, hasn't it? Let's be honest. We certainly know what to sort of expect now from the rest of this mod. Why is there, like, blood or red things in the back of here? Is that just bad lighting? Like all this. Uh, well, okay. And because it's, um, because it's uh, not in the workshop as well, um, we don't get the whole workshop screen, so the map just goes into a, a, an infinite loop. That's great. All right, let's check out map number two. I mean, I don't really know how to even... I don't even know how to sort of critique this mod, um, other than just a, just a map pack. I, I guess we just got to view it as a map pack. I mean, sure, but I've got the portal gun already. Antlion's pretty big. Pretty blurry. Let's try jumping into this. Really? Okay. Am I being dumb? Probably. to go through the bottom of it. Ha. Huh. Or I, I could just, you know, run run down here. And do that. It's gonna bounce. Hmm. 
There's just like lots of little spaces and places here where... I don't know. It clearly seems like I'm meant to get through there or be able to get round the back there somewhere. I mean, it could be more of a case that we go through here and that's a return path. I mean... Alright, well, that would make sense to do that, I guess. What? What, what? What is even going on? Right now. I... I Okay. I don't even know about the exploration meek, to be fair. I mean... I mean, I can't get into there. I mean... There's got to be something over here for them to put that portal surface there, knowing what we did on the first time round, but... There's a fizzler there stopping us. Quite clearly. So... I don't see any other way to... get anywhere else, really. I mean, great, you've got some BTS errors and some, like, exploration bits, but it's not particularly clear unless, hold on. So there is somewhere to shoot on that. I mean, the window to hit that, though, is pretty pretty minimal. Oh, no, it's not. I'll take that back. Oh, we are dreaming. We are dreaming of when the good maps are coming. Keep in a Portal One kind of styly chamber. Oh, that was uh, that was a bit disappointing. All that effort to get into here, and then there's not really much going on here, other than a bit of a Ratman den. But hey, me. Uh, sorry, let's start that one again. Hey, Megus, what's going on, buddy? Hope you're well. Hey, errand, errand, errand. What do the water bottles remind you of? Maybe Maggie is real. Alright, well. At least that one was slightly better. More. Maybe that. At least that BTS was kind of better done than the previous one. Maps? No. Alright, so then we got the Dreams of Science beta map. Oh my god, I mean, look at that. Look at that there. 
Look at that texture there. They've not even rotated the texture. I mean, yeah, okay, I understand it's a... It was called a beta map, but... Come on. Sure. Thought there'd be a way into there. Guess not. Okay. It's got to be a way into something somewhere, though. Um, also, just want to make a point. If I was to, you know, drop down here, is there actually a way back up for me? Because it's pretty easy to drop down here. Just saying. I'm guessing the answer to that is no. So, this kind of seems like with this one, we've just got a PTI export, but we're starting the player outside of the chamber. I mean, textures aren't even lined up properly. God, what what are we looking at here? Everything's very very bright. No, there, there there is no competition. I mean, I'll give I'll give Aperture Island its dues at least that with Aperture Island. Um, can I just drop down there possibly? At least with Aperture Island, it was a a fully compiled mod. And we didn't have to manually load maps, so. Alright, so. It reminds me of, um, I can't remember if it's The Simpsons or Family Guy, there's one episode and they're, they're doing, I think it must be Family Guy because the, sorry this, this glass looks terrible. Um, it's uh, Family Guy when they do one of their cutaways and then everybody watches Family Guy. Um, and it's an acting family. I can't remember who it is in, uh, exactly. And they're arguing about who's the worst actor. And their dad just comes along and goes like, Kids, kids, stop arguing. You're both just terrible. <laughs> it's like, yeah, there's no competition really. They're both just terrible. Why is there gra gra glass growing on the concrete of the observation room? Once again, I, I take you back to the comment, me, um, Megist from the last few streams why isn't there let me answer that question with a question why isn't there Why not? Why not? Why isn't there? Why? <laughs> I, I, okay, that's too many questions. I'm all for answering, answering a question with a question, but that's just too many questions. I'll be honest. 2016. 
in that blocky test subject waiting area. I mean, the walls just go nowhere. Kind of backs up the theory, you know, and, and the... And these are too thick and these are totally the wrong texture. This is meant to be like a... This is meant to be like a support beam texture. I don't even think it would look better if you stretched it out. To make it fit properly. But yeah, it kind of validates the point about being a um, an export because there's just... The BTS is just non-existent, really. And um, if they've done the map in Puzzle Maker, it would, we would assume. I mean, what's that? What's the point in that? Also, turn it off. They've done the map in Puzzle Maker and then they've just tried to sort of pad it out with some BTS stuff as well afterwards. Um, so where did the door open? It said door closing, door opening. I guess that's the door. Which leads to nowhere. Huh. So, this is the end of the regular chamber. They've just put a brush here with a texture over it to stop you from getting to the actual exit door. Okay. Let's try map number two. Still in beta, of course. Um, I don't think I have, no. Z fighting. So, this is exactly the same as the uh, map we just did. Moments ago. I wonder if there's anything different in the BTS. Should we take a look? Well, you say that though, but um, here in the UK there are actual signs. Also, this wall is very, very thin. Uh, the, the, we, we have signs in the UK which basically say this sign is not in use. And um, whilst that may seem a little bit weird and a little bit um, like funny, it, it's mostly paired with an electronic sign. Hey, we actually caught the elevator this time. There's no uh, cube maps though. Um, yeah, so it, the, the signs literally say this sign is not in use. But so, so to look at it, it's like, what is the point of this sign? Um, but they're normally by, by the elect the big electric signs you see on um, motorways and like major roads, and it's talking about like the electronic signs. But it's it's really weird to see. All right, well that map was disappointing. Um, Dreams of Science Beta Map D. Beta Map D. But yeah, that's what I kind of think when uh, you just said that, uh, Megist. Oh, I thought. I thought Portal couldn't handle the, uh, the beta map either. I thought it was going to crash. <coughs> Man, here I am trying to be an ambassador to Pepsi Max. The damn thing nearly tried to kill me. What? Well, I enjoyed playing this map three times, that's for sure. Also, ant lines. Ant lines. I 
I mean, I don't know why I'm trying to solve this again. I mean, there's, there's really no point. Unless there's something different in the BTS. Which doesn't look like there is. It's just another rinse and repeat of what we've seen already. Alright, next. Beta map three. What's the guess what's the bet in this is gonna be the same one again? Answers on a postcard. The winner will get Oh. Nope, it's not the same one again, but it is this one. Well Again, unless there's something different in the chamber here. Then I'm not even going to give it the time of day. All right, so the next one we have got map run without rules part one. Also, look at look at how these two are spelled, right? Map run without rules. And then we have map run with without. Spelled completely different. Oh, I, I shouldn't really complain. It's not fair for me to uh, to comment about English language because A, I don't speak Oh my goodness, I don't speak it well myself half the time and I'm a native English guy. Oh my goodness, cube maps. Where's your cube maps? So... Um... Is it Impulse 101? Or is it Impulse Space 101? Wow. That's what I was looking for. If I could spell Fulbright. Well, this is something. This is something. This is an absolute thing of beauty. I loaded the wrong map. Well, um, what can we say about this then? What can we say about this? <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what to say about this one. This is... Um, This is really disappointing. I mean, again, what's the point? Maybe there is, but 
I'm not gonna go look for it. <laughs> All right, map escape. This is looking promising. If I had to guess, I think we might have to escape. This seems familiar from something, I don't know what. Oh, it's a roller coaster map. Okay. Okay. Oh, look at them skills. I mean, do I really need three cubes, though, to, to take it there? Panel doesn't look suspicious. I'm like you're gonna let us get. I mean, look at this. Look at this. This this is a prime example, right? This is this is supposed to be a mod which you would expect like a degree of hammer work done. Yet, look at the check marks. That just proves where these check marks are proves it's an export, and this door wasn't originally here. I mean. Shock. I so wasn't expecting that. Testing complete. Please restart. This is our life now, guys. This, this is this is all we're doing now for the rest of the stream. We got restarted, therefore we must complete this test over and over and over again. Like the drone that we are. What if I was to not go out here? Okay. Well, I guess that's death. Death. All right. Well, that was once again disappointing. This is preview two. Um, okay. Do I need to go up there? Press those at the same time, it does nothing. 
Yo, Bremick, what's going on, buddy? I just don't know where there's a meant to be a cube. There is meant to be a cube somewhere. It seems, however, they forgot to put the cube in the mud. But you know what? I can help. Also, what was the point in that? Something behind that panel. I mean, I don't even see. Possibly. I mean, it would make sense that this be a dropper area. I mean, this kind. This kind of looks like a almost like a, a piston platform area but yeah I guess it would make sense oh look at this we're at the stairway to heaven and he's climbing the stairway to heaven dun, dun, dun. I'm good thank you very much Bramic very good indeed even better shortly once we uh, get to the end of this. Oh my goodness, what am I looking at here? Can I get across there? Check if there's a death trigger, what, down the floor? I mean, I'll be I'll be completely honest this kind of reminds me this is kind of like looking at myself in a way um, if somebody had like been on my hard drive and seen all the ridiculous amounts of um, portal 2 maps I've got um, that I've started as hammer projects and never finished. This is just like looking into that, in my opinion. But I would never like package it all up and say, hey, play my mod. Because it's not this is not a mod. This is just <clears throat> a load of crap. Um yeah. Alright, let's just check for this. Uh I mean there's, there's loads of weird things going on here. And, uh, hey Deathwish, what's going on my man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Please join us for yet another absolutely fantastic Portal 2 mod. I'm stuck in a funnel. I can't get out. We're marooned on a small island in an endless sea. Confined to a tiny spit of sand. Unable to escape. Do not lean on the railing. Uh, what railing? So which way do we go? We've got two ways to go here. Let's, um, let's go this way, I guess. And then... This kind of reminds me a bit of the... I guess that's permanent. It kind of reminds me of the um, uh, Wheatley sections of the game. Can I go in the vacuum? tube? I guess not. Just for decoration. It kind of reminds me of the um, Wheatley vacuum. I mean, I suppose they, they intended you to get the funnel and then come across to here, but... As I proved a minute ago, you don't need it at all. Yeah. You should check the workshop for Rectorox's guide and also Demon Arisen's video tutorial of how to make good test chambers.
I mean, sure, I can walk into there. Is there... If I was to go all the way up to the funnel, is there something at the top here? I mean, these, these are horrible. These textures are horrible. But, you know... Like we said before, quite clearly, it looks like an export, so... What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. Can we change a mod? Absolutely not. What's wrong with this? Only the best content here, boys. We only play the best of mods. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. And we like these mods because they are so good. We're going to play them all because they're dynamite. <laughs> Ah, uh, once again, the exit is blocked off. It takes you to that and that. Well, that was preview. Was that preview or was that preview two? That was preview two. We've not tried preview yet, boys. Death Wish with the 11 months. Tier 1 Twitch Prime resub. And uh, thanks to uh, Deathwish's subscription, I get the Pride World emote. Whatever that be, of course. Deathwish, thank you very much, buddy. One more until you get that. Is it a gold badge? Yeah, you, you've almost got your gold badge. Whoop, whoop. Uh, all right, so I think this is the same thing again, isn't it? This is just literally the same thing again. It's m but this time we have a cube. Oh my god, we have the cube this time. How the cube spawns over here, I do not know. The cube is here. The cube is here. Celebrate good times, come on. There's a party going on over here. Uh, yeah, well, we don't need to explore this map. We've played it once. I assume his idea here was to actually have live turrets that would be shooting at you. I'm guessing, as I say he, I'm guessing they never got around to doing that. Um, and also, if I was to throw this in the goo, yeah, it's uh, pretty broken. Pretty broken. All right, well, that's another another map by the dust. Do you know what this? As as rubbish as these maps are, this feels like one of those like one of my proper like old school lunchtime streams. Oh my goodness, where I just used to sing all the time and make up songs and and do weird stuff. Do you know what? I didn't actually realise that was textured there, but. I will take that polygon. We've got some sort of blob monster going on over there. We've got a damaged core. Oh, I'm talking like proper OG. I'm talking proper OG freaking streams. Back in the day when I used to wake Deathwish up in the morning. He'd be like sleeping away in his bed and all of a sudden his computer would start making noises. You know, I'm talking about those sort of old school days. I even remember the time that um, Deathwish went on vacation and he was a pot bum here probably. Death Wish was watching me on vacation. Good times. Good times. <laughs> A 
That mic went through a lot. I've still got that mic, actually. I've still got it. It's down here somewhere. It's in my big pile of junk. Here it is. Here it is. This stream just got interesting. Old school. Old school OG knock mic with a a mic cover that didn't even fit the freaking top of the thing, man. It's like miles too big for it, but... <laughs> OG, man. OG. Alright, I'll tell you what. Let, let, let's plug it in now. Let's let's just scrap the, the, the audio quality a minute. Um, let's just stop for YouTube for a minute. Let's try and get through the rest of these. Um, so we've only got a few more to go. So I will complete this for science. <laughs> this is like the start of every portal mod ever. I'm mean, going to be completely honest, I mean, they, they they kind of, dare I say, they kind of have some, or had some, relatively good ideas of things that they looked like they wanted to do. They just don't really seem to have executed anything very well, which is what's really let them down here. Uh, also, I don't know why I, had, why I wanted to come up here, when I want to be over there. Man. Don't talk to me about that pile of rubbish, man. Destroyed aperture. Wow, I just uh, okay. I guess uh, I guess this is our life now. We're just gonna be chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cornch, and shooting some portals outside of the school. When a couple of guys called Atlas and Peabody, they were up to no good. Started making trouble in my neighbourhood. I got in one little fight and Gladys got scared and she said, you go into the relaxation vault. I can't finish it. <laughs> I don't know how to finish it. It was going so well. Uh, okay. You do it every day but correctly. You do what every day but correctly. <laughs> you can live with rat man and eat beans while you're there. Because you're moving to it via auntie and uncle in Bel Air. Uh, I don't even know what I'm doing here. What am I doing? What is the point of this? There, but I don't think there's a portal surface now that I have access to, so I'm screwed in that front. Oh no, of course, because there's this portal surface right here, which is covered in darkness, of course. But that doesn't really lead anywhere, so it's uh, pointless. I mean, I just, I, I, I just. <sighs> Sigh. that thing meant to be. <laughs> I don't 
think that's their attempt at a um, custom portal gun holder kind of thing. <laughs> ancient sex device. Man, I'm glad it's ancient. Oh, well, this looks more of that puzzle again. That we've already played through it, I don't know how many times. Also, it's a bit of a flaw that you have to put your portal that direction. Well, you know, at least the map ended properly that time. I, I don't know. I just, I get people experiment, but I wouldn't call this a mod for sure. Like I say, I can see in places they had some really good ideas. They just haven't executed them well at all. Although I will say this looks like it's potentially fully hammer. I don't know why I can't. There's no player clip here, though, to like, let me come straight up here. Um, but, okay. I guess this is going to be an outdoor area. I had my reservations about it though when I was downloading it earlier on and it said that um, you know the maps don't load on their own or anything. And you can play them in any order, then kind of straight away it kind of gives you alarm bells ringing. I mean, this is a pretty nice area, to be honest. This is, considering compared to what we've, we've seen, this is a pretty... Ah, uh, yes I did. Um, it's a pretty nice area. They've actually tried quite hard on this, and it looks quite nice. Uh, but let's go on to the final one. And then we never have to touch this ever again. <laughs> and... I mean, the styles don't make sense. Like, those end lines aren't in this style, are they? Pretty sure they're not. Cool. So, this is our life. We don't get another chance. That that's it. We are stranded in this testing sphere for the rest of eternity, and um, that's it. That's that. That's life. I was fully expecting this uh, platform to vibrate and rumble when I land on it, like you do in the campaign. And uh, through the elevator we go. Whee! Fantastic. Well, guys, what can we say about Portal Dreams of Science? Portal 2 Dreams of Science. I'm glad it's a dream. I'm not being harsh, but I'm glad it's a dream. This is, I don't know, it, it just seems like a guy or a person came along and said, okay, I got some ideas for, a, I got some ideas for some Portal 2 maps. Um, let's throw all the ideas, half finished, into a map pack, call it a mod, and release it to the public. Um, you know, kind of like, like I said earlier on, it kind of reminds me of, like, my own kind of hammer map and my kind of processing. I've started many a hammer map in my time, many custom projects, and I've just never either had the time or the confidence to actually finish anything and release it to the public. Um, I'm always quite I'm always quite nervous, I guess you could say, about was that always open? Huh. Okay. 
Yes, it was. Um, I'm always I'm always quite nervous um, and apprehensive about you know releasing something um, because I'm can be quite a perfectionist. So if I think people, um, not that I, I don't I don't want criticism, but I, I want things to be perfect, and that's one of the reasons as well as I don't have time um, that I've never released anything Portal Two Hammer related. Um, but, you know, I don't, definitely wouldn't want to release anything Portal 2 Hammer related that looks like this. I mean, I'm, yeah. This is, is not good. It is not good. Anyway, guys, um, that's going to bring us on YouTube to the end of um, this uh, mod, if you can call it a mod. Um, we'll be back uh, real soon with the next one in the list. Hopefully it will be a bit longer. I think it's uh, is it one called Epsilon, I think, possibly next, or something similar to that. So uh, stay tuned. That will be coming real, real soon. But until then, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Take care. See you later. Bye.